Greetings everybody, my name is Fury and welcome back to uh, more Red Dead Redemption 2. I am back here in Valentine, continuing onwards. We uh, did some little bits of debt collecting the last time we were here and uh, didn't end as well as I planned. And man, Arthur, dude, you need to chill, buddy. I'm getting a feeling some bad things are going to come our way after all of this. We also have our new big guy, so that's cool. Ooh. Is that the, uh, who said that? Hello. Howdy. Hey, there he is. He's over here. Buddy, how you doing? How you been? Hello, mister. Hey, buddy. It's good to see you again. Hey, mister. Mister. I never learned your name. I never did. You're like a brother. But <laughs> I didn't learn your name. And I said to myself, Mickey... You never learnt that fella's name. Now, you'll never see him again. And you'll be sad. Like when your puppy passed. Because you slept on it. What's your name, mister? Mm, Arthur Morgan, my friend. Arthur. <laughs> Arthur? <laughs> I love that. He's so resentful my about it. uncle's name was Arthur. Uncle oh, man. Arthur, we called him. On account of his name. A fine name, a strong name, like a king. King Arthur. You could be my king, Mr. Arthur. Yes, you could. Well, that's very generous of you, my friend, but I think we'll be okay. Alright, so we are back here. I don't know what's going on. There's another bounty on the board. I might grab that and go see about doing that. I tried doing one a little while ago, but I kind of done goofed, I think, when I tried doing it. So I just want to do a bounty, and then I think... I am looking for a bounty. Thank you, thank you, Chief. What do we got? Ooh. Ellie and Swan. Wanted alive for questioning. Be paid for the rest of Ellie and Swan. One for crime of matricide. The above amount will be paid immediately for the delivery of the prisoner. Uh, the Black Widow. She has been in the Cumberland Falls area with an unknown male. Wait, didn't we already did this? Hold on a second. Didn't I already do this? Well, now I don't remember. That one? They say she's sleeping rough near Cumberland Falls. There's more. They say she ain't sleeping alone. No. I got it. Alright, well. We got enough crap around here from the last time. I mean. Cumberland Falls. So, is that just like a repeat? Yeah, this just makes me. This is just hunting her again, right? I mean, you know what? I can't say no to a $25 reward, though, let's be honest. And then after that, I think what we're going to do is we're going to go see Reverend Swanson and see what he's been up to. We also need to go see Dutch. Find out from Dutch if they found a buyer for the stolen bonds yet. Hosea is up to some shenanigans. And we also have a situation going on with Javier Escuela. Alright, well, we can do that, I think. Just gonna grab old good boy here. Come here. We got you, buddy. I love my horse. This guy's coming with me. I don't know why I feel like I've done all that before, but hey, I could be wrong. Alright, let's go. What the heck? Oh. You guys alright? <laughs> Damn. So, uh, have another drink and go see your wife. Jesus. Hey, mister. Howdy. Well, I don't think he's doing too good. I I could have done something there, but I don't know what I could have even gone to to do that. We're not going to question it. Anyways, let's be off. Let's be on our way to Cumberland Falls. I'm pretty sure we did do that last time. 
Yeah, the Black Widow. So I'm assuming once you do like one or two of them, they just start repeating some of these. Maybe that's it. I am yeah, mistaken. I'm gonna have to go back and look at my videos and see if I actually did it with this one or not. How are these guys coming along with their house? Ooh, it's looking good. How do, Chief? Hey, Mister. Oh, hello again. Good to see you again. We're moving along slowly, but less than surely. It's looking good. I got more chance of teaching a pig to sing opera than to turn this pair into carpenters. <laughs> it don't look so bad to me. Uh, I asked God for sons, and he sent me donkeys. Ain't that right, boys? Oh, come on. Don't put that much pressure on them. Uh, they're doing fine work, as far as I'm concerned. Alright, so. Uh, she's not that far away. Okay, so we'll go deal with her. And then we can head off and uh, deal with uh, Reverend Swanson. Now, I'm pretty sure we have done the bounties, so those are out of the way. Unless somehow the game just put me back here again all of a sudden, which I don't think it did. I'm going to have to check my saves. Your horse is dirty. Oh, I got a cleaner. I got to clean you up later, buddy. I got the chance, we'll bring you back and uh, get you some good old cleaning. There you go. There you go. Oh, what the heck? Oh, right. This is the farm that we were at. The one that we totally didn't kick in his teeth. I swear. Yikes. I mean, I didn't really do anything. I just threatened him. What the fuck? Well, now that seems suspicious. Anyone out here? Just a dead deer. Hmm. Not gonna worry about it. Who knows how long that's been sitting there for. I don't think we should take that back for uh, the camp. That would not be good. Ooh. Probably wouldn't taste good. That's for sure. Ooh, there's a camp down there. I see some sort of little firelight down that way. Hey there, Chief. Can I get down there? Or is that too steep? Uh, nope, we can go down here. What's going on over here? Oh, wait, that's that little... Fisherman's cabin, I think. Who was that before? There you go, good boy. You're all right, boy. Hey, get yourself gone from here. All right, all right. I just wanted to see what's going on. Whoa, Hold your horses. Yep. Yep. Hey, at least that's easier. Crossing the river that way is much better, in my opinion. Locate Ellie Ann Swan. She's wanted alive. I know she is, but dear God. Hmm. Ah. She's down here, apparently. How many times are they going to let this chick go? Pretty sure I already caught you once, didn't I? No, you don't.
No, you don't. You come here. Ah, no. I didn't mean to kill her. Wait, I didn't even kill her. I got her though. Sorry, buddy. Well, I can definitely see why she's called the Black Widow. <laughs> Alright, it's okay. It's okay, buddy. We're gonna get you going, don't worry. You are coming with us. After what you just was going to do to him, and then I accidentally downed him, I didn't mean to. There you go. Upsy daisy. Upsy daisy. Let's see how this goes. Oh dear. What well, came over me? Did I, did I just do those things? Oh yes, you did. It's a, it's a horrible blur. But I see blood. Uh. There's blood everywhere. Uh huh. You won't come out. I'm not like that. I'm a good girl. R really. I promise I am. You believe me, don't you? I don't. don't you, mister? <laughs> I do not believe that for a second, ma'am. I think you are a cold-blooded murderer. Ahem! <clears throat> Not counting what we just did. That, help, that okay? doesn't count. I, you didn't see it. I have an illness. <laughs> a fever of the brain. I, I, I've done bad things, but... A jail... A jail ain't where I belong. Mm. A sanatorium, maybe. Get me help, mister. Please? Ma'am, I don't Save think that... Me. That's Save not gonna me help you. That, that, I hate that. I really hate that. I don't know why that deer is glitching out there. It's just... You're such a strong man. So tough and burly. Ma'am, you need to stop like talking. You, I wouldn't be in this mess. My men folk, they all been weak. That's what my problem's been. And that's why you keep killing them then. How I got in this unfortunate situation. Uh-huh. But a big strong man Jesus, lady. I do not like her. Straight and narrow. What? Come on. I hate you, you sad sack of shit. I wish I'd cut your belly open and show you your guts. There it is. Gutless bounty hunt nobody. I hate you. I hate you. I hate you. I hate you. I wish you'd die. And there it is. Well, I hate to say it, ma'am, but you're not going to have a good time here. Come on. Got your bounty, Sheriff. You're going to be happy with her. <laughs> Just get me there. You're no fun at all. I'm afraid I. <laughs> Thank you, Arthur. Yeah, no, I'm uh, very happy to turn her in. Here you go. You order a lady killer here, Sheriff? <laughs> Dude, she survived a shot to the heart. Put her in the cell, won't you? I, I protest my innocence. I protest my innocence. Mm. She might be a little shaken up. She lost another fella out by the falls. Poor dear. I was trying to save that dude. Dying around you, don't they, Mrs. Swan? Now I hope you'll be comfortable, miss. She'll be fine. Now come get your money off the desk here. I wanted to save that guy, not shoot him by accident, but uh game was like, oh no, you can't do that. Thanks, Sheriff. Appreciate it. The black widow herself. This town's so starved of women, I'm sure she could find herself a husband yet. Uh, <laughs> Indeed. I mean, she may find a husband in jail. This town's got more pressing problems than outlaws. Gonna take some time off posting bounties, impose law and order on the streets. All right. That man has a heart of stone. It's silly to keep me locked up in here. I mean, what am I gonna do? Lady, you Just are lucky. Let me out to exercise a little. 
That's creepy. I'm immune to your charms, Mrs. Swan. It's so boring in here. Can we have some fun, Sheriff? Just the two of us. And to think you were sniffing around this office at one point. Oh shit. I'm lucky you was charmed by another. So she was actually looking her around the office. Interesting. And I could spread them all over. Like Miss Moria? Don't you dare mention Mora again. Now hush. Damn. <laughs> oh. Show me some sympathy, Sheriff. I'm a widow. A poor little widow. You forget? Sorry, I want to hear this. About you, but at least you respected the sanctity of marriage. <laughs> Death do his part. <laughs> I was about to say that. She beat me to it. All right, let's go. We're done here. Literally, till death do us part indeed. Well, at least she's not going to be having any more husbands to do that to. And that's for the better. I'm okay with this. <laughs> We've ruined her ability to do such things. Alright, let's get going, big guy. Time to go see what uh, Reverend Swanson's up to. You will probably want to see us. Aww. Jared, I love this. I love the fact you're, that you can just have such a good fucking about relationship with your uh, horse to make sure that they're well and ready to do everything you need to. I was trying to think on how we can level up the uh, speed a bit more. Hmm. I guess we just run around mostly. Run around, feed them hay. I'm trying my best to not spook them though, because I don't want to get bucked off, thank you. Alright, so let's see what we got out here. Not much going on. Man, Reverend, where are you? You're all the way on like a train track or something? Where are you, bud? Dude, I don't think, have I been out this far at all into the hills? Well, I haven't been out to here. So, there's still lots of land area to check out later on when we get the chance. Uh, I'm going to have to do that. And I think I bought... Okay, I'm seeing things. I thought those were people. Did I buy a varmint rifle? I did! I got the varmint rifle. So now, we, if we need to, we can uh, hunt smaller critters with that. I'm seeing that the bow still does quite a bit of pelt damage to most animals, so I'm trying to stay away from using it if I can. Ooh, not the tree. Thank you. Watch where I'm driving. <laughs> or watch where I'm riding, not driving. So, I don't know. Oh, whoa, whoa. What the fuck was... The hell's happening? Open the damn lock. Well, give me the damn key. It's a stage company lockbox. We master help. Oh, Driscolls. <laughs> Woo! There you go, buddy. I got gotcha. you. You all right? Yo, Chief, are you okay there? You all right there? They ain't gonna harm you anymore. Ah, oh, shit! Stagecoach operator's dead. Mister. I don't hardly know what to say. Oof. Thanks, I guess. You've done me a service. Happy to be of assistance. Hey, look. The stage company's gonna write this off as a robbery anyway. If you can get in that lockbox, you can take what you want from it. Is that so? Stealing if it's already stolen. Got that right. Well, thank you, Chief. Word of advice. You see anyone might could be in O'Driscoll, head the other way. <laughs> and he's gone. Well then. Sweet, so we can have whatever's in the lockbox. I'm down with that. Appreciate that, Chief. Yeah, these Driscolls, they uh, dress pretty shittily, don't they? So what, is this the lockbox? Need a lockbreaker. Ah, damn it, how do I get a lockbreaker? How do you get a lockbreaker? Need a lock breaker. Ow! Well, this is a sad day. 
No lockbox for me. <sighs> Man, I don't get any money from that. Oh, well. Unless I just take that carriage with me everywhere I go. Probably not a good idea. Alright, I'll look into that then. I don't know how to get a lockbreaker, so uh, somebody else knows. Would love to know, please. Or maybe the game is going to show me how to get one. I don't know. That'd be pretty sweet if it does, though. Doo -doo. You're doing good, buddy. You're doing good, boy. Ooh, train station. Ah, is this where Reverend Swanson is? Yes, he is. Reverend, where are you hiding? Where is the Reverend? Reverend, where are you? Reverend? Swanson? You here, Reverend? Swanson, you in here? Swanson. Reverend! Is he in there? Let's go check him. Reverend Swanson, are you... Mr. Ah... I took your advice, sir. I took your advice. <laughs> and your God has finally deserted you. What you talking about? I took your advice, sir. Which advice? I have removed myself from Morpheus's embrace. No more shall I sink, sir. He's I drunk. I am free. I am free. You don't seem free, friend. You seem drunk. Sit down, Reverend. We ain't finished. You ain't finished. Look at him, he's finished. None of us force liquor down his throat, friend. I just want him to play. Oh, First fair enough. He ain't friends. Don't make no mistake on that subject. Now, secondly, he can't hardly see, let alone reason. Now, reasoning ain't never been one of my strong points. Neither <laughs> would see, and I do just fine. You want to step outside or do a business here? I just want him to finish the game. Why can't we all just get along? <laughs> These are good men, Arthur. They're children of God. Ah, uh, Reverend Man, God. you are... And he's he's out. How's about you playing this place? Huh? That seems fair. Fair. Uh. Sure. You want a game? Eh, sure. What the fuck? Why not? Sure. I'll play a few hands. I I will lose because I do not know how to properly play. Reverend, where are you going, buddy? Where are you crawling away to, Reverend? Get back here. I'm Luther. This is Marvin. Nice to meet you both. Okay, poker. Fortunate for you both, we're being gentlemen about them. Oh dear God, because I am horrible at this, so send help. Okay, over several, each player is dealt two cards. Yep, 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 yep. Okay, that fold. I know how to fold. Ha, <laughs> ha. Know how to fold them. Yeah. Sorry, all in a player places all in. Don't want to do that because that can be bad. Hand ranking, poker and rankings from strongest to weakest. Royal flush, an ace, king, queen, jack. Oh, and ten. All the same suite. So I'm assuming that's like the highest one. So royal flush. Damn. That's a that's a hell of a hand. Okay. Uh straight flush, five cards in sequence, all the same suit. Oh, okay. Straight flush, got it. Four of a kind, four cards of the game rank, and one side card. Okay. So it just has to be four cards of the same type. Full house, three cards of the same rank. Only three, got it. Flush, five cards of the same sweet. All right. Straight, five cards in a sequence. Huh. Okay. Three of a kind, three cards of the same rank, and two unrelated side cards. Alright. Hmm, okay. I'll have to get used to this, I guess. Two pairs, two cards of matching rank. And one pair, two cards of matching rank, three unrelated side cards. Okay, well, I'm gonna do my best here. Same goes for you. No promises. Uh, so, are you two know each other anyway? Okay. Don't seem like the likeliest of friends. You don't mind me saying. We go a long way back. <laughs> and now you're his chaperone? I guess it's something like that. Can we play? 
There we go, let's do ten. Just a little. Let's add a little bit onto it. He committed about five cardinal sins just in that chair you're sitting in. I think he used to be. He's drifted a little in recent years. Drifted. There's a challenge to all of us. I don't know if he's drifted, man. I Can you imagine him at the pulpit? If he could stand out. On the fourth day, he turned water into whiskey, and I don't remember much <laughs> after that. <laughs> I like that. That's fucking great. Good. Oof, the stakes He's are getting higher here. He's going through a bad time. Disrespect him again, and you'll find yourself in a bad time, too. <laughs> all right, all right. Just trying to have a little fun here. It is a game, after all, mister. Yeah, that's fair. You know what? Let's let's let's. Uh, I don't know how much money I have left. Let's let's put some more money on the table. How about it? Yeah, I know. Pretty pathetic. <laughs> Jesus, you play like my grandmother. I'm pulling a bad hand here. After the fifth community card known as the river has been dealt, there is. Oh, I missed that crap. Uh, it's Arthur's turn to bet. Hold Archie to view the oh, community cards. So we got a ten of hearts, ace of. Diamonds? I forgot which one that one is. The seven of... Bleh. King? Queen? Oh, it's a queen. Diamond of queen. And eight of hearts. Well, I've got a ten and a... Queen. Shit. <laughs> that doesn't help me at all. <laughs> you know what? Screw it. We're going in. Give me. All I can afford. I'll call. All right. Oh, here. Pile of crap. Yay, I got... Looking good. Okay, let's do this. Hellfire. Huh. Okay. Ooh. I'll take it. I didn't cheat. Uh, sweet. Gambler number one. Uh, well, I hate to say it, boys, but it's got your friend to bless my hand before he passed out. As much fun as I appreciate this. Drunken fool to bless my card before he passed out. Hmm. You know what? Just, just, just for pure curiosity, let's put it up to forty. How about that? Let's see what happens if I do that. Here. Oh. Here we go. He's going in. He's going in. All right, let's do it. I reckon I'll go all in. Oh god, what am I doing? Hmm. Let's see then. <sighs> I had it. You're sitting pretty, huh? Nah. I lost it. That's fine. Whoa. That's more like it. Ah, crap. Damn. Oh, no way. Nice. He got this one. Fair enough. Gentlemen, this is getting too rich for me. Sit down. <laughs> oh, I'm done, friend. Been a real education. Come on, Rip. Reverend Swanson's gone. Where Where'd he go? Who? The Reverend. Where is <laughs> Excuse me, gentlemen. We play a few games and now we lose the Reverend. God Reverend. dang it. Reverend Swanson. Where'd you go? Oh, God. You can speak to other people in the world. Here, hey, boys, have you seen the Reverend? <laughs> Excuse me. I'm sorry. You, you see a drunken idiot, a priest, wandering about? Sure. We saw him. Smelt him <laughs> and avoided him. <laughs> he went that way, I think. Thanks. Thanks, brothers. I look kind of crazy, mister. Well, you have no idea. <laughs> Hurry at Swanson. Come on. Get back here, buddy. We need to have a chat, my friend. Oh my god, Swanson. Oh boy, here we go. I see the pigs. Alright, so... Let's make this quick. <laughs> ooh, ooh. You're going down. Ow, rude. 
Yeah, get him in the head. No, Arthur. Woo. Stay on the ground. Got him. Wait, I didn't kill him. Hold on. Get back here. I didn't. I didn't kill him. Get back here, you. Ethan. Come here. We have to have a discussion. We have to have a serious discussion. <laughs> oh my god. Fuck. You, sir, need to chill. Come back. Hold your horses. Come on, man. Oh, come on. Uh. Alright, restart mission. I was trying to get him to stop. I should have done that. Uh, let's do from checkpoint. Okay, I was assuming we weren't supposed to kill him. Just kind of tell him to piss off. I didn't mean to kill him, if that's what happened. Get back here! <laughs> Damn, Arthur, good jump. Hey, you. Get back here. No, not this time. You're not getting away this time. Ah, oh, damn it. Difficult. Yep. I I won't tell us so. All right. All right. That's good. That's good. You're not gonna tell a person, are you? Now get out of here. Shut. Got it. I didn't kill him, so we're okay. Reverend, get off the damn track. Oh, for God's sakes, Reverend Swanson, what are you doing? What are you doing, sir? Get down from there! God damn it, Rev! Oh dear. Oh dear. Go, go, go. Oh god. Oh god. Wow, Arthur. Wow. I mean, I appreciate it, but damn. Reverend. <laughs> oh god, what do I have to do? <laughs> I got it, I got it, I got it. <laughs> okay. So, uh. Thanks, sir. Oh, no, you don't. <laughs> What the hell is wrong with you? What the hell is wrong with you? And you made me lose my hat. Off a bridge like there that. was a goddamn train, you crazy <laughs> bastard. Have I been bad again, Mr. Morgan? Unfortunately, you have. I'm sorry. Uh, oh, buddy. I wish I was different. <sighs> a drunkard reverend. It's Let's kind of upsetting. Home. Come on, buddy. Home. Yeah. That's a wonderful idea. I could have tea with Margaret. Margaret? Who's Margaret? But... <sighs> Alright, I got him. Come on, Reverend. Let's get you home. Oh, uh, boy. So, uh, I think we found our troublemaker. <laughs> what was that laugh? So I guess we found our uh, troublemaker in the state of things, huh? Reverend Swanson's a bit of a... He's a bit of a loony, I guess I should say. But I like him. He's fun. Although I can also see that he's... Uh, really facing some pretty terrible shit, probably. 
from what I can already tell, the man has an unfortunate, very bad drinking problem. Come on, man. You didn't get the flush of diamonds. <laughs> Don't mind us. We're just passing through. He needs some rest. We need to get him home. Shut <laughs> up. Hey, camp, we're back. We got you a present, too. A good old Reverend Swanson. Man's a, a bit uh, bewildered. Man is definitely a bit bewildered. Oh, my lord. I like him, though. I do like him. He's a fun, fun character so far. Just, I just hope nothing bad actually happens to him. He seems okay. Alright, Reverend. Come on. Come on. Time for you to take a nap. Really <clears throat> flush out your system, my friend. Maybe uh, not have a drink for a long time, right? Maybe never? Would be preferred. Hi, guys. I was wondering when he'd show up. <laughs> I got him. Oh, hey, how's it going? Okay. You're too easy on him, Arthur. Eh. We still got him back. That's all that matters. He's safe. <laughs> you better sleep your way to salvation, my friend. Oh, what happened? Just the usual. Poor bastard. Exactly. Well, thank you, Mr. Morgan. I'll keep an eye on him. He was lucky this time. Real lucky. Very lucky. <laughs> All right, Swanson, you stay, uh, stay there, buddy. Rest up. Yeah, I did not mean to uh, kill that dude. If I did. Arthur. <laughs> oh yeah, Dutch wants to speak with us. Let's not. We're not going to talk to Dutch yet. As much as I'd like to. Uh, next on the list is Hosea. Reverend Swanson is going to take a well-deserved little nap. And we are going to go see what, uh... Arthur? Yeah, hello, Uncle. I don't know if he likes Uncle, but Uncle is Uncle. What can I say? Alright, come on, boy. Now, can I have my hat back? <laughs> Please, I would like my hat. <gasps> my hat! Oh, it's the wrong hat. Mm. Wait, can I, um... I mean, it is a hat. It's not the hat I wanted. Meh, I'll take what I can get. Oh, I can brush you while you're riding. That's cool. <gasps> Give him a good brushing. Give him a good brushing. Good boy. Yeah, that's a good boy. Sorry. <laughs> I'm happy, okay? I'm happy. We get to look after his well-being, okay? If anything happens to this horse, I will riot. I want you to know this. I will riot. This is my horse. Alright, so... I'm going to switch over to the rifle. That. What the... Oh, I'm hearing things. That was, uh... Something. I don't know what it was. Some sort of creature out there. Ooh, look at all the deer. Might have to get one. I wonder if we use a varmint rifle on one of them. Would we be able to get a certain pelt from that? Ooh, horses. That one's pretty. Oh, they've all got their own little styles to them, don't they? Hello. And then there's the wagon. I know I don't really... Oh. Hey, Chief. Um, well, now, I'm assuming he's, yeah, he's dead. That man's dead. He's not gonna be needing this, right? I don't think he needs it. 
we're gonna go. Come on, boy. Sorry about your horse. Yeah. That that took a little bit off me, didn't it? Damn it. Oh hey, but I'm doing okay. Hey, I'm in the okay zone, okay? Look, I'm not being a complete dick. <laughs> I don't think, anyways. I hope not. Snakes. Oh, it's okay. That's okay, boy. So do Varmint Rifles work on snakes, too? Out of curiosity, to get the great snake pelts? Somebody want to uh, describe that one to me? Or would you have to use, like, a knife or something on them? You're doing good, boy. I'm, I'm starting to say it. Oh my god, this man's accent is... I love it. I'm sorry, I love it. Yeah, nothing out there. Okay. I guess we got what we got, so we can just move forward then. It does look like there's something over there, though. I'll go take a peek. Let me be mindful here. Oh, a dead carcass. A deer died out here, I take it. Have I been out this way? I don't think I have. No, I have not. I have not been out here at all. Hello. Stable. Is there a town out this way? Your horse's health will refill slowly when the horse is carried. Hello there, chief. Evening. I didn't get to read them, sadly. Sorry, I just want to go see what this is all about. Also, do not mind the last time. The aliens and spooky skeletons kind of had me going there. Ooh, I am coming way the heck out here. What in the world? That is... oh god, that's a lot of boars. Hello! Ah, uh, friend or foe? Hey there, mister! Whoa, whoa, whoa. What the hell are you doing here? Okay. Get the hell away from here! Alright, foe. Yeah. I'm sorry. I don't know, I see a camp and I want to come visit. Leave me alone, alright? Oh, there's a house here. Houses? I'm moving out here, have I? Hey there, Chief. Howdy. Evening, mister. How you doing? Quite a place here. You're a lucky, lucky fellow. See you around. Okay. Don't know what that's all about. Have I been here? Oh. All right. oh, it's a stable! Interesting. Very interesting. Why is that out here? Hmm. What's with the music? Uh-huh. You, you want to repeat yourself there, game? Yep. Sorry. The music has got me a little spooked now, all of a sudden. It's like, hmm, what's going on? Is it because it's nighttime? What's happening here? Anyways, we gotta go see about Hosea. Oh, a loon! Right? That's a loon. Pretty sure that's a loon. Then again, I'm pretty sure I'm a loon. Eh, it wouldn't be the first time. <laughs> da, 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 da. Da, 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 da. Ooh. This is a neat little area. Emerald Ranch. Emerald Station. Okay. Cool. Hosea? an interesting way of putting it, James. Uh, no doubt. I do interesting very well. Hello. I don't do so well. Please. 
So what's the business here? He's our new partner. I ain't no such thing. Perspective new partner if he likes this. Liking ain't the problem. Trusting is, as I said. Keep your voices down. Ooh. I don't want my boss here. This is a sideline. Of course. Look at us. Honest as the day is long. Exactly. I'll tell you what. Let us prove ourselves. <laughs> prove ourselves? To this clown? What you talking about? Good day, Hosea. Good luck with your business dealings. Listen. What are we doing? He's rough and ready and quick with his tongue, but I swear you can trust him and trust me. I'm an old man. You're not old, Seamus. I'm old enough. And you know why I ain't dead? You don't trust idiots. Exactly. We're not idiots. Let us prove it to you. Hmm. Okay. I'll tell you what. Arthur. Old Bob Crawford and his boys just bought a beautiful Ooh. stone stagecoach from upstate. It's in their barn. Now you go get that, and then we can work together. Okay. Bob Crawford, an acquaintance of mine. So you want us to take out your competition? Well, he, he's not just an acquaintance, but a cousin. Oh. Marriage. I also want to see if you boys got what it takes. Now you survive that. Where is he? Well, he's in a farmhouse just northwest of here called Carmody de Dell. What's nice like is there? The train tracks as you're heading up towards Fort Wallace. There's also some money in that house, but that's your business, not mine. But don't kill nobody. Folks know we ain't intimate no more. They'll know it was me. But you're fine with us robbing your cousin. By marriage. By marriage, yes, yep. I love it. You heard the man. Let's go rob his cousin. Okay. By marriage. <laughs> <laughs> I like that. Cousin by marriage. So we're going to go rob his okay. cousin by marriage. Really? Really? Lead the way. He said the place is just northwest of here. Me? You're hmm. the one who's been out gallivanting around here. That's what you call it. Clearly <laughs> you've recovered from your bear encounter. Well then, this is gonna be fun. Hello, horses. You that better, couldn't you? Hey. You wanted me here to show some strong arm. That's usually how it goes. Yes, but you know how this works. Come on, Jose. That feather's a joke. Mm -hmm. Look out, Arthur. And that's why he's perfect. Sorry, Jose. No causes any problems. A safe mm -hmm. spot to fence wagons and coaches? That's easy money for us. I guess you're right. Come on, it's not like he's asking us to rob a bank. That's true. It is just coaches. Coach from Seamus's old crooked cousin by marriage. We should hang up our hats now. <laughs> hmm. Here, you know what? Get the feeling that if I'm doing this, I may want to put this on. Right? Can I put that on? Ah, there we go. Yeah, we probably don't want to get identified by his his crooked cousin. Question mark? Nah, cousin by marriage. I'm assuming we don't want to get spotted by him. You're doing good, boy. All right, Hosea, how are we doing this? As of you've seen, I am not good at stealth by the looks of it. I mean, we could go steal some stuff from a train. That would also be pretty simple, in my opinion. Go take what we can from the train. All right, so let's hide the horses here, and then let's go get it. That must be the place up ahead. We should go on foot from here. I agree. Let's see what we're dealing with. Come on. Follow Hosea to scope out the Cormier. Oh, right, yeah. There's the house. You see the barn in the back. Stagecoach has to be in there. All right. So, and they said money in the house. So, do we want to take the money okay. in the house? Let's take a quick look at the place. Quinn wheel and press to view item wheel. And then I'm assuming we want binoculars, right? Oh, <laughs> hey, Isaiah, how's your head? Look at the home. Nope. Okay. I reckon we could do it now. Sneak in, and I'll get the coach. I mean, you it's... can try the house. Or wait until morning, and I'll head over, distract them by putting on a little show. 
Well, you sneak into the house, find what you can, and then get the stagecoach. What do you think? Uh, ooh, that's a good question. Yeah, let's do night. Let's do now. All right. I reckon we're ready. I didn't. I didn't have time to respond. I'm sorry. I actually accidentally didn't respond. Maybe take a peek through the windows before you go in. You got it. Sure it's all quiet. Well, I mean, even if it isn't quiet, I have a rope that I will tie him up with. Okay, sneak up to Carmody Dell. Assuming somebody's in here, maybe. I don't see anybody there. Ah. Yeah, nobody there. Shh. Shush. Oh, I can't look through that window. Okay. Probably have to go through the back. Okay, Hosea is working on the coach. I will work on the money. Do, 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 do. Anybody in there? Nope, nobody in there. I'm assuming that window is also just part of the next room over. Nothing. Okay. So, upstairs, maybe? Ah, he's sleeping. Okay. So, he is very much asleep. Got it. Ooh, how are we going to do this, then? Technically speaking, I feel like I could maybe uh, tie him up if anything does go wrong, right? Well, let's just do it. Let's just go in. Rob the house of $45 worth of items. Shit. Be quiet, Arthur. Just don't go into his room. Don't knock anything over. not waking up, I hope. Let's go upstairs. Oh, shit. Oh, boy. I don't like this. Quiet, Arthur. Quiet. Whew. Okay, we're looking at 35. Shh. Shh. Rest a bye, baby, in the treetop. When the bye breaks, our portal will rock. No, I don't search the chest, damn it. No deaths. Alright, Hosea. We got the money, let's go. Get on, dear boy. I got the money. I'm coming, I'm coming, 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 coming. I'm on. Come on. Huh. Get on and let's head back. I know, I know. I'm on, let's go. We're good. 
Ooh, <laughs> not bad. Stealing it during the day. No deaths. And we got it. I'd say that's a job well done, in my opinion. I was actually expecting myself to somehow mess that up. I'd be very flabbergasted if they were, like, following behind us all of a sudden. Like, wait a minute, we've been robbed. We got everything we needed. Do, 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 do. <laughs> <laughs> Less problems the better right now. Just need to get this back to Seamus in one piece and it's a good night's work. <laughs> all right. I wonder how much we get out of this. So what were you able to lift from the house? A few bits and pieces. Nothing Bobbles. Well, we need anything we can get right now. Yeah, that's understandable. This was easier than hunting a thousand pound grizzly anyway. <laughs> <laughs> no doubt. I won't forget that in a hurry. Uh, I'm sure the thousand pound grizzlies we didn't like us. <laughs> Jose is a good storyteller. I like him for that. Not sure. Till we can't, I suppose. Feels like we're starting mm. to get back on our feet, slowly but surely. Just need to keep at it. Dutch has a new money chest stashed in a safe spot away from camp, but it's a long way from being full. Okay, here we are. Just pull the coach into the barn. Now. Right, Dutch was talking about that. Something about the money chest being an uh, item that we can get our hands on, or that he's trying to get back, supposedly. Hello, Seamus. We met your cousins. How was it? Fine. Nice people. Very quiet. Park that thing in here. Quickly. I got it. I'm doing it. I'm doing it. Hold your horses. We got it. Done. Uh, nice work, Jose. Mostly art, like I said, coarse but competent. Here. <laughs> Thank you. If you find any other coaches that need selling, I'll see what I can offer you for. Them. Ooh. But discreet, you know. Of course. Goodbye, gentlemen. I'm heading back to camp, I think. You coming? Mm, sure, why not? I might as well go with uh, Jose. Oh. We can have a good storytelling, right? Is Jose going to regale us on the way back home? Or is it just a little trip back to the camp? Nah. Straight back to camp. Nicely done. Well played, Sir Arthur. Well. Arthur, not Sir. I'd say we did a damn fine job. And those bits and bobbles I might put in the camp uh, treasury. Hello, ma'am. Three hundred dollars? Stolen wagons and Seamus of the wagon fence and Emerald Ranch. Dang! Okay. Holy cow! Oh, I might have to try this out at some point in time. Due to buying stolen wagons, Seamus runs a fence. Visit a fence to sell valuables, buy illicit goods, or craft talismans and trinkets. Ooh. Well, I think we may have to go back and pay him a visit then at that point. Because if he's got stuff like that, I kind of want to check that out. Thanks for the ride, Hosea. Well, let's, uh, let's rest up ourselves, I think. Me thinks. I guess we should. Uh... God, though, that was that was pretty good. Hello, Arthur. Hello. Let's see what everybody's up to at the camp here. You don't worry about your souls. You probably don't even have them. Oof. Dude, he is just having a bad day. Uh, give item.
Sorry, I was listening to his conversation. Yeah, no, it sounds like Reverend Swanson is just not having a good time at all. Wait, is that all I can give? Really? Is that all I can contribute? Is there, like, a maximum? Okay, I wasn't actually expecting that. I didn't think we'd have, like, a maximum on that end. Huh. Okay, so we've already spent, like, a little bit of money on some stuff here. I'm trying to think what we need. We need food. We need more food. Food is good. Some real variety, chewing tobacco, premium canned goods. Mm, that's actually pretty good. Pearson's Wagon, and that's 45. Sure, I'll take it. Quality and quantity of food available at the pantry has increased. You can pay to resupply the pantry when stocks are low. Hell yeah, I'll take it. Not bad. So that came out of our money, right? Treat ourselves. Cocaine, chewing gum, and assorted sweets. Nice. Ah... Nah, I think we're okay. I might do some more upgrades on that stuff later. We could use some ammo. Lodging. First things first. Dutch wants something comfier. Of course, Dutch wants comfier. Horse station. Be great to have more room to hitch. Some local farms are selling off old coops. And leather work tools. Better tools. He can make extra gear. Okay, fair enough. Price 225, 175. Oof, that's a tough choice. Here, hold on, hold that thought. Can I put more stuff in the camp before I forget, or is that it? Because I still had stuff on me. Uh, give item. Is there like a maximum that I don't know about? Maybe I'm missing something. Okay. There we go. Ooh, okay, yeah. So we put 300 in. Well, in that case... What do we want? Oh, we have just enough for the comfier lodging. Or we can buy the chicken coop. Ooh, that's a tough call, tough call. You know what? Oh, encourages others to donate. Ah, okay, that's actually really smart. Okay, you know what? Yeah, let's let's do that. There. All right, so other amenities members have been inspired to contribute more. Cool. So there will be more contributions that are not just mine then. That's just pretty sweet. Oh my god, next in line, Arthur wants a map to help plan journeys. Upgrade Arthur's lodging. Unlocks the fast travel map. Ooh. Travel to previously discovered locations. Also unlocks grooming supplies. $325. Yikes. Fair enough, though. So, stagecoaches, you said? <laughs> oh no, he's, he's losing it. Hey, Swanson. And yeah, Reverend I Swanson's little losing it. Like a lobster. Found some cash in that old Driscoll cabin, but not much else. A shotgun. And no coal? Not for now. No. Nah, we tried, though. Okay, I'll catch you later, then. Uh-huh. Uncle? Uncle? Hello? If you're bored, there's always work to be done. <laughs> I ain't bored. Yeah, fair enough. All right, Uncle. We'll leave you be. All right, well, I think then at this case where we are is pretty good so far. I would love to have my hat back, though. I like this hat, but the hat that I ended up buying was pretty nice, too, to be honest. Wait, I have others. Where did I get this from? Where did I get this from? Eh, yeah, sure. Uh, this one. 
And I don't have any outfits, do I? Own hat, stalker, worn gambler, beaver. That's kind of cool. All right. Coats, vest, shoots, pants, suspenders. You know what? I'll save this as an outfit. Because why not? Saved costume outfit. Done. There we go. Oh, I didn't buy any chaps last time, did I? No, I didn't. Interesting. Okay. Masks. Wait, I can I can buy multiple masks. Ooh. Ooh, okay. You know what? Let's let's not use that mask. <laughs> I'll be removed in camp. Got it. Yeah, probably probably don't want to go wandering around in that. <laughs> Just uh, my own precaution here. Uh, inspect. Can I look at myself in the mirror? What is this? What are we looking Dear at? Dear Arthur. Oh! I've written this letter a hundred times or more, and I cannot get it right. It's me. You know it's me from the bad handwriting. I know I said when we last spoke, and I was going off to get married, that we would not speak again. I know I said a lot of things. An old lover of I Arthur's? Them, I suppose, at the time. But I'm not so proud as to not speak to people who care for me, or cared for me. I've been in Valentine for a couple of months. Oh. I had some bad luck, and, well, it's a long story, and not an interesting one. But I am here for now. I saw a couple of the girls, or whatever the polite term is for them, that ran with you and your associates in town. And I heard tell of a man who sounded like you. I would love to see you again if you could spare me a little bit of your time. Hmm. I'm renting a room at Chadwick Farm, just north of Valentine. All Yours, right. Mary Linton. Ooh, all right, cool. So, Mary Linton then. So she wants to see us. Wait, do we get... Oh, I can't save the game. Why? Oh. Thought of saving, isn't it? That's cool, though. Uh, no, we are not shaving. Are you kidding me? That beard is staying. No one's taking that beard away from me. No one. Examine the photo. Who is that? Is that Mary? Assuming that's Mary. What else we got here? Zoological... Oh, Zoological Compendium. Ooh. So these are like the animals that we can see. Okay, cool. I will keep that in mind. Examine... What is this? Flower? Huh. Huh. That is a weird looking flower. Sorry, I guess I haven't actually been at Arthur's table properly, to be honest. Rambles, the woods and plains. Okay, this is probably one for plant life, I'm assuming. Yep, mushrooms. Cool. Alright, I'll keep that in mind too. We can definitely use that. Alright, Arthur, it's time for you to get some beauty sleep. Let's do... Till noon? I think noon's good. Nighty night, Arthur. Nighty night. And then I guess we have a few other missions to do later, but that's probably what we're going to call it today. I still like that. I like that it actually transitions like that. That's cool. Bum, bum, bottom, bum. Oh, what are those photographs from? Huh. Okay, I'll keep that in mind. Sorry. I'm uh, having too much fun trying to dig out details here and there. Alright, so I'm going to put a save right on here. And I think, ladies and gentlemen, this is where I am going to call it for the night. So, I think we've uh, kind of gotten at a pretty good spot right now. 
we've at least managed to figure out that we can go do some cart hunting now and sell carts, which is awesome. Uh, we've upgraded the camp, which is good, which means more people will start donating to it, I guess, after every job, which is nice. So I'm kind of excited to see how that turns out. But other than that, I think, uh, I think that's what we're going to call it for tonight. The bounty was still fun, too. So thank you, everybody, for joining me on this grand journey through Red Dead Redemption 2. And I will see every single one of you in the next one. Have a good one, everybody.